Want to master the keto diet? Ever wondered why it's so popular among health enthusiasts? Well, let's begin by understanding what it is. The ketogenic or keto diet is a low-carb, high-fat diet that's been sweeping the wellness world. This diet is all about minimizing your carbs and upping your fats to get your body to use fat as a form of energy. Its popularity isn't just a trend. Fitness enthusiasts, athletes, and even ordinary folks have been praising its potential benefits. Some of these include weight loss, improved energy levels, and better brain function. It's also been linked with helping to manage certain health conditions like diabetes and epilepsy. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. The keto diet is a major lifestyle change, and like any change, it comes with its own set of challenges. So, if you're intrigued and want to give the keto diet a whirl, stick around as we break it down into easy, digestible steps. To master the keto diet, understanding the science behind it is crucial. Our bodies are like engines, they need fuel to function. Typically, the primary source of energy for our bodies is carbohydrates. When we consume foods rich in carbs, our bodies break them down into glucose. This glucose then enters our bloodstream, and with the help of insulin, it is transported into our cells, where it's used as energy. This is our body's default energy system. However, when we limit our carbohydrate intake, as is the case with the keto diet, our bodies need to find another source of energy. This is where fats step in. When carb intake is low, our liver takes the fats we eat and convert them into molecules called ketones. This process is known as ketogenesis. Ketones are an efficient and potent source of energy. They can cross the blood-brain barrier, meaning they can provide energy to the brain, which is crucial as the brain is a heavy energy consumer. The state in which your body is primarily burning fats and ketones for energy is called ketosis, hence the name keto diet. But how does this lead to weight loss? Well, when your body is in a state of ketosis, it's burning fat for energy instead of carbs. This means it's also burning the fat stored in your body, leading to weight loss. And since fats are more satiating, you're less likely to feel hungry and overeat. It's important to note that reaching a state of ketosis isn't immediate. It usually takes two to seven days of following the diet strictly. Also, while in ketosis, it's essential to maintain a balanced diet to ensure you're getting all the necessary nutrients. So the science behind the keto diet is all about shifting your body's primary energy source from carbohydrates to fats. This metabolic switch not only helps in weight loss, but also has been associated with other health benefits like improved mental clarity and energy levels and better control of blood sugar levels. Now that you understand the science behind it, you're one step closer to mastering the keto diet. You might be wondering, what exactly can you eat on a keto diet? Well, let's dive into the culinary world of keto, a place where high-fat, moderate-protein, and low-carb foods reign supreme. The trick is to focus on the foods that fit these categories, while also ensuring they are nutritious and diverse. Starting with the basics, meat is a keto diet staple. This includes red meat, steak, ham, sausage, bacon, chicken, and turkey. These protein-packed foods are not only delicious, but also keep you feeling full for longer. Next, we have fatty fish. Think along the lines of salmon, trout, tuna, and mackerel. These are rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which are essential for your brain and heart health. Eggs are another must-have. They are high in protein and can be prepared in a multitude of ways, making them a versatile addition to your keto meal plan. Now let's talk about dairy. Butter and cheese are not just allowed, but encouraged. These foods are high in healthy fats that your body needs for energy on the keto diet. Plus, they add a whole lot of flavor to your meals. In the world of keto, nuts and seeds are your best friends. They're low in carbs, high in fiber, and packed with healthy fats. They're also great for snacking on the go. Don't forget your greens. Low-carb vegetables like spinach, broccoli, and zucchini are key to keeping your meals balanced and nutritious. They're packed with vitamins and minerals, and their low-carb content makes them perfect for the keto diet. On the other hand, there are foods you should avoid. These include sugary foods, grains, fruit, beans, and root vegetables. While they might be healthy in other diets, their high-carb content makes them a no-go for keto, so there you have it. A quick guide to eating on the keto diet. 
It might seem daunting at first, but once you get the hang of it, you'll find that there's a wide variety of foods you can enjoy. Remember, the key to a successful keto diet is balancing your food intake and keeping it diverse and nutritious. Ready to get started with the keto diet? Here are some practical tips to make your journey easier. First and foremost, plan your meals ahead. It's always easier to stick to a diet when you have a clear plan in place. Start by making a list of all the keto-friendly foods you enjoy and build your meals around them. Remember, a well-balanced keto diet should include a good mix of proteins, fats, and low-carb vegetables. Next, hydration cannot be overstated. Drinking plenty of water is crucial on any diet, but especially so on the keto diet. As your body adapts to burning fat for fuel, it can often lead to increased water loss. Therefore, it's essential to replenish these lost fluids to maintain proper hydration and support overall health. Now let's talk about sleep. Getting enough sleep is vital for overall health and well-being. When you're well-rested, your body functions better and you're less likely to crave unhealthy foods. Aim for at least seven to eight hours of sleep per night to keep your body and mind in top shape. Don't forget to incorporate exercise into your routine. While diet is a significant part of the equation, regular exercise can help speed up your transition into ketosis and enhance the benefits of the keto diet. Whether it's a brisk walk, a session at the gym, or a yoga class, find a form of exercise that you enjoy and make it a part of your daily routine. Lastly, but most importantly, listen to your body. Everyone's body responds differently to dietary changes. If something doesn't feel right, it's essential to make adjustments as needed. Don't be afraid to tweak your diet or consult with a healthcare professional if needed. Remember, the goal is to find a diet that works best for you and your body. With these practical tips, you're well on your way to mastering the keto diet. Like any new endeavor, there are common pitfalls to avoid when starting the keto diet. Let's delve into some of these mistakes and how you can sidestep them. One common mistake is not eating enough fat. Sounds counterintuitive, right? But when you're on a keto diet, your body switches from burning carbs to burning fat for energy. So skimping on fat means your body won't have enough fuel, leading to fatigue and hunger pangs. The solution? Incorporate healthy fats into your meals. Think avocados, fatty fish, and nuts. Next, we have the problem of consuming too much protein. Yes, protein is essential, but on a keto diet, an excess of it can kick you out of ketosis. Your body can convert excess protein into glucose, which is not what we want. So aim for a moderate protein intake. Another common slip-up is not getting enough fiber. When you cut out carbs, you're also cutting out a lot of fiber-rich foods. And without enough fiber, you may experience digestive issues. So how do you fix this? Include low-carb, high-fiber foods in your diet. Foods like chia seeds, almonds, and leafy greens can help you meet your fiber needs without sabotaging your keto diet. Lastly, expecting immediate results is a frequent stumbling block. The keto diet is not a magic pill. It takes time for your body to adapt to burning fat instead of carbs. So, don't be discouraged if the scale doesn't move as quickly as you'd like. Remember, slow and steady wins the race. Be patient with yourself and give your body the time it needs to adjust. By being aware of these common mistakes, you can avoid them and stay on track with your keto diet. So, are you ready to become a keto diet master? We've journeyed together through the core tenets of the keto diet. We've delved into its scientific underpinnings, unraveling how it turns your body into a fat-burning machine. We've explored the diverse landscape of foods you can relish, from avocados to zucchini, and everything in between. We've also armed you with practical tips to kickstart your keto journey, making the transition as smooth as possible. And let's not forget the potential pitfalls we've addressed, ensuring you can sidestep common mistakes and keep your progress on track. But remember, the keto diet is more than just a pathway to weight loss. It's about embracing a healthier lifestyle, nourishing your body with quality foods, and reaping the benefits of sustained energy and improved well-being. With this guide, you're now equipped with all the tools you need to master the keto diet. Remember, it's not just about losing weight, but also about leading a healthier lifestyle. Good luck on your keto journey.